I miss Stampy from that other world. I miss Stampy. He was a good pet. He was a good cat. He's a good orange cat. But not the real Stampy guy. Just the... Just a, um... Just a cat I had. In Minecraft. Oh, I'm Mertens! I miss her too. Oh, you shouldn't be stepping over her grave. Oh, I miss these pets. Aqua! I loved him the most. Why? <laughs> Jesus! Why does it do this stuff? Why does it do this stuff to me? To me. Aqua, do you want revenge? Is that what you want? Ow! He bit my leg. Bad Aqua. Bad. Hey everyone, Knuckle Six One Five here. Went to another Minecraft Let's Play video where today. I'm going to be showing you another building episode. See all the stuff I threw out. Um, anyways, we're going to be building a jump scare grave. Yeah, I got this from Magma Mucin. In case you didn't see his video, I'm doing it. So we got this little graveyard here. Which, it's a tiny graveyard. Which I had, which actually had the pets that died in my other world because we had to kill them. Anyways, when I have a bunch of stone in my chest, so I do that. Fantastic. Yep. I think I'll take a lot then. So. So let's get to a clean, so let's get to an open spot. Place stone pressure plate. You need to put, you need to destroy a block. You need to destroy this hole with blocks destroyed under the, under three stone coming from this pressure plate. The redstone. This block, this block, this block, this block, this block, this block. Place redstone dust there and play and destroy some dirt. Then you got your whole layout ready. Now, what you're gonna need to do if you're on console, this is easy. If you're on PC, this is wait, if you're on console, this is hard. If you're on PC, it's a different way. So if we just put rails right there, cover this up. And what that will do is if you stop on the pressure plate, the redstone will activate, which will activate this these powered rails. 
So on PC, you would get two rails, place them here and here, and then place an armor stand here. But in console, you have to do it different. Oh wait, I'll be right back. So you're also gonna need red, one redstone torch and one piston. By the way, you need three powered rails, 15 redstone dust, one pressure plate, one armor stand. But on PC, you'll do it like I said. But on console, you have to grab an armor stand, place a piston next to it, put a redstone torch. Wait, no. Oh, wait. Wait. Actually, Oh, I have it. Actually, you want to place the armor stand on top of the power, on top of one of the power rails. And this is what you do on console. Uh, I forgot to add a minecart. Not a minecart. Okay. It's fine. It's coming from creative. Replace the minecart. And then when the when the armor stand looks like this, when it's in the middle of the minecart, that means it's in the minecart. I need to do this quick. Then, grab a zombie head, place it on, move this minecart, put two stone slabs so it's a block, place another two stone slabs on top of that so it's another block. Place two stone slabs at the side so it makes a cross shape. And then you'd want to push the mine cart under the slab. Put the ground, put the brown carpets, and it's completely hidden. And then you want to decorate it so it looks less suspicious. I don't want to step on that yet. I mean, it's a little bit, it's a little bit harder to reset on console than PC, but it's still a little bit easy. Well, actually, it is easy. Put some oak wood. You need eleven of those. Put three here, three on the other side. And five of the back. And then put jungle weeds on top of those. And put azure bluettes next to the brown carpet. You can you can use bone meal. I'm using a poppy and tall grass because that's what that's what magma got. When he did it, he a cookie, and then yo trap is done. Your trap is done. It's basically done by this point. I'm just gonna show you. You can put anything. I guess you could put. You can only find these in swamps, so I would say grab it from creative. And then, prank your friends. And the way to reset it, 
break this brown carpet, or if it's on this brown carpet, break that brown carpet, and then push it back under the slab. And now, you're done. You might want to put some other graves, so it look less, so it look, so this one would have less attention. So once they step on the perfect plate, since it's stone, it's completely hidden from up here. So we might be able to see it. We might think it'll give it'll give them cake or something. You step on it, and they get jump scared. But you want to have a zombie noise to make it sound like it's actually going out. Going toward you, you can you can use command blocks. So that's why so that way it's a real jump scare. And that's it. You actually only needed seven redstone. So I do hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely click the like button and subscribe if you're new to my channel. And I will see you next time. Bye! Bye! Bye, I'm really bad at this. Bye! Waha!